Hello. Hello. <laughs> Can you tell us where we are and who you are? Well, so I will start with who I am. I am uh, Willy Spanjaar. I am project leader at the Green Village for the circular economy. And um, the Green Village is a lively um, living lab at the campus of the TU Delft. Okay. And here uh, entrepreneurs but also scientists can discover uh, new innovations uh, in a living lab. Nice. So what kind of projects do you engage with here in the Green Village? Well, there are all different kind of projects. They're not always technically based, so the research questions are not focused on the technology, but also on different aspects. For example, how do you implement it in a system context, but also what uh, kind of business model should apply on this, or uh, what kind of rules do we need to uh, make it uh, happen in real life. So we try to accelerate uh, innovations from a more experimental uh, setup until the real market implementation. What is your view on sustainability and circularity? Well, I think that those are to two different things yeah. and that they, that's very important that they be accomplished, but it's very hard to do yeah. because we don't know what it exactly is. Yeah. So we're having all those different things going on, like we should, be, have a, we should have a circular economy, we should have a data-driven economy, we want to have uh, climate-adaptive cities, um, and there's all wonderful things, but in the end we don't know where we're standing uh, in the future. Mm. So what we know is that we ha need an enormous effort to get the, uh, a, sus a sustainable uh, future in the end. Um, and we don't know how to, so we should test and demonstrate it first here mm. to see how it should work in the future and then we can scale it up. So the testing and demonstrating here is the core thing that you do in the Green Village? Yeah, we don't do it, but the entrepreneurs and the yeah, researchers use this uh, plot to do it. Yes. Oh, wow. Yeah. Now I get it. It's really cool. What do you see as the main drivers and barriers to a circular economy? Uh, well, there are a lot of different uh, drivers and barriers, but I think that in the end it should all fit together. So all the puzzles of your, the pieces of your puzzle should uh, should uh, be on the right spot. So mm. uh, you should not only be technical based, but you also have uh, hurdles in the business model or in your societal embracement, and you should fix them all in order to uh, get to a circular economy. So you should work together. Mm. Very what, what about government? I mean, regulation, legislation, that kind of thing? Yeah. Do your companies explore this with you here as well? Yeah, they do, because at the Green Village, this is a rule-free area, so you can experiment without having all those rules to bother you. Wow. So in that way, we hope that they can innovate in a faster way and be accelerated into a market implementation. Okay, but other places, this rule-free thing is, sounds really new. Yes, it is.